at the Yankee Stadium recently, a young girl was hit in the face really severely by a ball being thrown. Please forgive my lack of knowing the terminology in baseball. This is the third time this season, just at that stadium alone, that something like this has happened. This is an ongoing issue that's been going for a while. And recently, um, 30 Major League Baseball teams have agreed to extend their netting by a certain amount, and a third of those have extended even further. However, Yankee Stadium has not. So they came out with some, you know, lame line that said something about they've been looking into it, but they've been also receiving complaints from box seat fans who don't want the netting up. So to me, what that's saying is that you are putting your bottom line way above people's safety. And that is not just a missed opportunity, but a mistake in alignment for just, you know, brand reputation and, and trust with, with stakeholders. It goes to me, this is in alignment with the fact that they haven't taken action in the first place, right? So Shelly, you mentioned earlier, they're looking at business impact, but that's so short-sighted because people above everything else. And when you have a little girl who's in the hospital with blood all over, you know, the seating where she was sitting and people, to your point, crying on the field, um, that has an impact and that has way more of an impact than potentially needing to find new box seat fans. So it's, it's an alignment to, it just makes sense. Kind of it, the dots add up for what they did, what they didn't do and how they reacted after it happened. But long-term, I mean, this is, it might be a cultural crisis for them. I don't know. I don't know the organization. I don't know their values or, or the way they conduct their business other than this. Um, but to me, that's the makings of, you know, you need somebody to go in there and maybe potentially audit your mindset, and your culture and help you fix that.